So where are we going today? Well, Kate's been watching uh, a lot of My Lover, My Killer, uh, so I'm slightly concerned that she may be taking me to some obscure area to strangle me. Um, but she's told me the premise is we're going to look at caravans. So we'll find out shortly. Caravan Park, Gossip Caravans, and we thought we'd be able to like go in the caravans and look around, but I don't know, it doesn't look like we'll we might be able to do that. So let's go and have a look. Right, so you just walk in them apparently. Um Who'd have thought, hey, that you could just go in and look at them? I don't know. Crazy. This is an Eldis Affinity. I think this is probably a lot newer than a caravan that we would end up with. Um, I mean, that's the fridge. Even this feels like paradise compared to uh, the conservatory. <laughs> when you live in a conservatory for a year, it's like... Yeah, I have got the camera on wide lens so you can kind of feel a bit so you more. You can see all of me. <laughs> Very warm in here, so imagine I actually don't want to stay in here that long because we recirculated air. But... Wow. Oh my gosh. Like, we... when you look at caravans on eBay and then you look at this, you're like, maybe we can spend 20 grand on a caravan. <laughs> So I can't remember what the name of this caravan is, I'll put it on the screen, but this is like four grand more than the last one. You get a much bigger kitchen space. They've sacrificed that to this bit. Yeah, so beds. they've got rid of the extra bed bit. This one isn't heated though, is it? And this is the much, much bigger bathroom space, actually. Well, well it's got a wardrobe in it. It feels bigger. Yeah, you've got that much extra space, like where the toilet is, basically there. Yeah. And the toilet would have been there without this cabinet there. But then that's cut into this. Like, this is not as good for me. Yes, you've, the got, layout. A, you've got a wardrobe, but... Okay, so we're now in a Unicorn Valencia, which I think might have been a previous smoker's home. But this, you've got the permanent bed space. Now, I haven't seen many of these on eBay, any unicorns. What did you say when I said I've not seen many unicorns? Who has? Yeah. <laughs> I do like this idea though a lot of just having like a little bedroom space. But then look at that cut off corner. It's like, who's, yeah. who's gonna be the unlucky one with the feet hanging off the edge of the corner? That's true. Got your fridge there, oven there. Where's the bathroom? Oh right, but the sink isn't there. The sink obviously should be there, but... So not. this is priced at £13,000, which is crazy considering that it's missing, like, whatever goes in there. It's missing a sink. There's some mould or something growing. Yeah, you've got some mould on there. Yeah, there's mould down there as well. Yeah, mould on the floor, like, someone has smoked in here previously, you can tell. Mm. Um, okay. Speaking. Right. Oh. Very oh, wow. Look in there. Yeah. 
I mean, why not? This is a caravan place. Why the f have they not cleared it up? Like, just at least like it. It is weird. Like, why not just treat that mould and seal it up? But I guess they're just after maximum profit, minimum effort. Um. So this, this is a ball berth, isn't it? It must be. Just didn't look. Because it's got the bathroom at the end and everything. This is just the exact same layout as that other one. It's just cheaper because it's a bit, because it's really mouldy. I mean, you can feel like how wet. I have no interest in continuing. Well, either. I just want to see, because, you know, we're obviously not going to buy this, but I mean, it's such a big cooking and kitchen space, but. Like, Even that's then, just look how poorly, what... like, there's no... Oh, I do like this bathroom, though. There's well, no, actually, the toilet... There's no actual space here, though, is there? You know, I mean, it's a shop or anything. You've got that. That's it. Yeah, then you've got that big I mean, I sink. Guess you can use this, but... Yeah, you've got the drainer on the sink, and you can use... You, ca you could chop on that, but it might get a bit messy. But, um, again, though, the layout for what we want is not ideal. John's basically pushing me out of here, he's not happy. <laughs> this is a sprint away Lux. Ah! Oh my gosh, it smells really bad. Why are you doing that? I'm not, I'm just sitting here. It smells like, you know, when a bin has bin juice. Oh, and there's some water coming in. Yeah, this is Dripping. like some kind of hillbilly hideout in Red Dead Redemption 2, where you, someone's taking you to take someone to kill them yeah this is Grim. um this is like ten thousand pounds yeah ten grand Nothing. and it smells like bin juice no thanks seventeen thousand it's very small let's see if this one smells like bin juice I don't think there's a shower in there. Oh, it probably comes out of the sink. Uh, I don't think How are is. you meant to use the toilets? It's it'll turn sideways. Oh. Um, this must be. There is be... no shower in here. I think that's the cooking. That's where you cook in one of these. Yeah, yeah look. Where? Oh, yeah. So you got your. What's under the other one? Oh, your sink. sink. Then you've got your seating and your bedding. This one smells a lot better than the other one, but for 17 grand. Right, so this is a coach man, but it's the same layout as the first one we saw, but it's smaller, John says. It's not as long as the other four births, which are pretty long. It's not so as it's just long. driving it around. <laughs> Yeah, I do like the idea of having a nicer bit of bathroom, really. A nicer bit. A nicer bit of bathroom. <laughs> Come to the two birth caravans to see the difference. And they look the same, really, outside. This flooring is a bit... Right, okay, so I get it. The bathroom... Instead of having it at the end, they've got it here mm. and the kitchen there. Come and have a look. So it's the combo. Right, okay. Yeah. You, know, you shower all over your bog. Yeah, which we. <sighs> and if you need to go for a piss, you got to get a wet bum. I don't know if you can say piss. Piss! So. <laughs> yeah, and then it just means that, like. So if we had that as a bed area. And then we changed this area into like a work area that folded away. There's still not much floor space to then do anything else. This is a Pegasus two berth. So yeah, you you definitely in a two berth scenario are looking at not being able to have a permanent bed space. And you could take that out and have that as like a workspace. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Is that like a fridge? That's an oven. Is that the oven? Yeah. It almost looks like a wine fridge. <laughs> we could make it a wine fridge. 
sorry, the lighting isn't very good, but um, I mean, this is a nice, this is a nice sized bathroom. I mean, for sure. Seeing if this is a unicorn Bailey or a unicorn Seville, because it says both. Oh, look at that fridge. This is quite interesting, actually, because this, this is more luxurious. Yeah, this is definitely fold upable, move away. It could be, that is it what could, I mean. It could be. And then you've got quite a nice floor space. Yeah, conceivably, if you just took that out. Smaller space there. Nice bathroom space, again, with the separate shower. Very nice. Wow. <laughs> it is. Why don't you come work here? Yeah. <laughs> so, I think that was useful to show us the kind of... Because we've not... Even though we've been looking at caravans on eBay and stuff, it's not really, like, dawned on us the kind of layout that might be useful to work with. So I think that actually has helped us with that. The most interesting, I can't remember the name of it now, but there's that four berth with the, uh, that was much shorter. And yeah. Yet, and yet the same layout as the bigger one. Yeah. Because I think that layout is probably going to work for us best to have. Or, well... If we just built a partition, you know, again, if we've got a shell and wanted to put this stuff in, like, it would. Yeah in theory work it's just about the positioning of the water and the yeah bathroom like the flaps or whatever but i'm assuming you can just cut them out and put your own flaps in <laughs> you can put your flaps in i'm not putting my flaps anywhere that's been useful so we're going to go home think about things um so is that it for this video i think probably should we say bye bye yeah if you've enjoyed it and you want to carry on following us, then you can like and subscribe and press the bell and all that kind of stuff.